What's happening, Recovery Fam? It's Aaron here again. Um, again and again and again and again. I just tried to make three separate videos. Each and every one of them didn't end up working out. Um, whether my phone died or someone called me or I lost my train of thought, um, they didn't end up happening. And it all happened like right as I was about to end the video, like 10 minutes in. Um, so anyways, I'm giving it one last shot. This one doesn't work to over for the night. It's incredibly frustrating. Um, anyways, I just wanted to check in with you guys. I just had thanks Thanksgiving, oh my gosh. Christmas Eve dinner. Um, if you couldn't tell, I'm freaking stuffed to the brim. Um, I am like too full. It was good, obviously, but I'm too full. Um, I'm like lethargic almost from it. Yeah, so it's... After this video, I'm going to probably take a shower and just chill out. Um, quick shout out, big shout out, Nick M. Thank you so much for the shout out, bro. Keep doing your thing. Let's keep pushing this recovery fam thing. I appreciate everything you do. Um, and I'm proud of you, bro. Straight up. Just keep just keep pushing with me. Keep pushing with me. Um, I wanted to get kind of down to the point pretty quickly of, of what I wanted this video to be about. You know, my my last few videos, I've been kind of like, I'd mention, you know, my little relapse or little slip up, you know, most of the little relapse, I say, you know, now that I think about it, that there was nothing little about that. Um, it was actually pretty bad. You know, I really, you know, I slipped up bad, you know, I mean, it was probably the worst it had ever been. Um just in a super short span of time, you know? Like, I f messed up hard for probably a few weeks. Um, you know, it's just crazy, like, sitting back and thinking about, like, you know, where I just was. Um, it's it's crazy, you know? Um, like, that one, that one could have killed me. You know, I'm not even going to lie. That one could have, I'm surprised that it, I'm almost surprised that it didn't. You know, like, there was a there was a reason that I was away from you guys, you know. If it was just some little reason, I wouldn't have been away from you guys. Um, you know, I really fell off hard. Um, you know, really hard. And I, it's amazing, you know, that I, like, got out of it when I did, um, just recently. You know, if I feel like if I wouldn't have, it would have been forever, you know, or until it killed me, probably. Um... You know, I don't know, I'm just, like, at that stage of, like, reflecting. Um, except for this time, I'm not letting it break me down. I'm just simply reflecting and taking everything for just exactly what it is, you know? Something that happened, um, and that's that. It's in the past, and I made it through it. But just thinking about, you know, how I you would just keep saying, you know, my you know, back from my little relapse, like, no, I, I don't, don't get it twisted, that was not, there was nothing little about that, that was major, um, that was really bad, I'm just thankful to s still be here, um, you know, it's, don't ever get too comfortable, you know, do not, don't get too comfortable, that's kind of the point of this video, um, not only that, we're not, we're not guaranteed to make it out of this, um, Sometimes it's easy to think, you know, to get selfish, especially when you're in your addiction, um, where it doesn't even cross your mind that it could be you, you know, you could be the one that the drug deal goes bad and you get shot, or you could be the one that gets the, the bad bag or the good bag, um, and it ends up killing you. Um, you know, we don't ever think that we can be those ones, you know, but you are that one, you know, it could happen. I'm that one, you know, it should have happened, it should have happened to me, I've had a handful of really close calls, uh, most of them not even from opiates, mind you, um, but I've had a few, you know, encounters with, you know, substances, and I really didn't think I was going to make it, you know, some of the nights, and it's, it's amazing that I did, you know, so just don't get too comfortable, and don't ever forget that it could be you, you know, your family could be the one that, you know, is mourning the death, you know, drugs took their kid away, you could be that person, 
um, you will be that person eventually. Me, I was I was lucky. You know, eventually it would have happened to me, but um, I guess I was kind of lucky. You you might be lucky too, but trust me, that luck will run out. I promise it. I promise you that luck. And if if that still doesn't make you want to get clean, at least realize that that's the truth and own it. You know what I mean? Don't don't try and deny that that's the truth. Just know, you know, that you you could very well be the, the next person that this sh stuff kills. You know? Um, and you have one life. You know, we only have one shot. Sometimes I get thinking about that too. I'm like, God, like, what is it? Like, what is this all about? Like, what? Like, what am I here for? So now I'm I'm trying to figure that out. Um, you know. But now I can actually figure that out. So I'm going off on a tangent now, and that's where this video is going to end. I got so much love for you guys. Thank you so much for all the support. I'm so happy to be here, be back with you guys. Um, let's just keep it rocking. We got something good going here, so let's just keep it pushing. Much love, recovery fam. Merry Christmas to everyone. See you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Later.